Good morning, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the KW Command 66 Day Challenge 7.0. And today is actually day 17. Sorry for calling yesterday day 17 when it was 16. But yesterday we did dive into the beginning of the referrals applet, and today I want to show you a little bit more that you can get accomplished using the referrals applet and specifically the map tab. So let's come back into the referrals applet again, our fifth icon down. And we are gonna go back into the map tab. Yesterday I showed you how you could search for production. However, you can also search for three other things really important here. Two that I wanna to highlight today are market centers and referral patterns. So let's say you have someone that wants to join Keller Williams and yet they're in another state or another city or a place you're not sure where Keller Williams exists if it does. This Market Center map is a fantastic place to find out who you might refer your friend to as far as offices go. So if we choose Market Centers, you can now see all of these dots on the map represent Market Center locations. And so if you start to zoom in, you can see that the dots actually start showing up where the actual office locations are. And as you zoom in further, you're actually going to begin to see now you have to be careful on this map because it's market centers. It's showing us locations, but it's also attempting to show us all of the agents that are at all of these market centers on this view. So sometimes it does hang up. It takes a little while because right now, literally it's attempting to load 175,000 agents. Now we're down to 20,000 agents still taking a while to download all of that. But let's say you had someone moving from Katy to college station. They're going to Texas A&M and they want to get their real estate degree. And you're saying, well, I wonder if I can refer them to an office in College Station. The reality is, yes, you can. You can click on any one of these office locations and you're going to see that we do have an office there. You can also see that there is an address associated and then how many agents are available there as well. Uh, you can always cross reference this, this with KW White Pages to then locate who that team leader might be. Or you could probably reach out to any of these agents, give them a quick call and say, hey, who's your team leader? Get a reference there as well. So that's market centers. The cool thing is that this map is not just national, it's also international. So you can see it's showing us market center locations that are part of KW worldwide as well. What's also fun is that you can actually scroll the map and we can cross the pond, if you will, and it takes a little while to load because obviously it's accessing all of the data, not only from Keller Williams, but Keller Williams worldwide. But if you let it sit here long enough, you're gonna to start to see that we're gonna have market center locations show up all throughout Europe as well. So there they are, they populated pretty quick. And again, you could zoom in on any of these locations as well. So if you're ever planning any travel and you wanted to go see how Keller Williams is done in a city, state, or country other than your own, Referral map tab market center is also a great opportunity. Now, the last one that I wanted to show you is not the market centers tab, but what is called referral patterns. So we're going to switch from market center to referral pattern. And the first thing it's going to do is say, hey, well, we can't receive any retrieve any patterns because you haven't put in a city. You guys know I live in Katy, Texas. So if I put in Katy, Texas on the map and choose that location, you're going to see that the pin gets moved and is dropped on Katy, Texas. And then I have all of these arrows going out everywhere. Well, what do these arrows represent? These arrows actually represent the top 20 cities where Keller Williams agents from Katy have sent referrals to. So you can see a lot of people move locally. They move from Katy to Houston. But we have people moving from Katy to San Antonio, Kingwood, Dallas, etc. This is great if you want to see referral patterns where people are moving to. But imagine sitting across the table from your sellers and say, Mr. and Mrs. Seller, I understand the last agent probably said they're going to advertise their property, maybe even do Facebook ads or social media ads. But did they tell you the top five cities where they're going to advertise your property in addition to our hometown? Oh, well, I actually have that data because as a member of the world's largest real estate company, we actually track referral patterns, which are loosely associated with migration patterns. And I can sort of see where agents are sending referrals from and to. And so if I click on this little box here, 
you can see the top five cities where people are moving to Katy from would be Austin, Houston, San Antonio, Frisco, Spring, Arlington, etc. So I plan on advertising your property, not only here in the Katy area, but I'm gonna run ads in the Austin area. I'm gonna run ads in San Antonio and in Frisco and in Arlington and maybe some in College Station as well. That way I can attract buyers that are not only local, but are statewide or even national buyers coming from. And you can even see, I think this is, uh, is this Laredo or Nuevo Laron? Uh, McAllen, yeah. So all the way down from McAllen, you can see one of the places where people are moving from when they move to Katy, Texas. So again, this is inside of the map tab. I have changed the drop down to referral patterns and I do have to have a city. That's how they decide where the referral patterns are being sent from and where the referral patterns are being sent to. Again, just remember this is loosely based on migration patterns. It's where the KW agent office is that sent the referral and where the KW agent office that received it, where their office is located. So sometimes you may not see a referral pattern for your actual city if you don't have a Keller Williams office located in that city. In that case, I would do your best to find the closest one and then use those referral patterns as a guide from there. That's it for today, guys. How you can use the referrals applet to track not only referral patterns, but locate Keller Williams offices throughout the world to send referrals to, receive referrals from, or maybe even just plan a trip to visit a KW agent or a KW office somewhere else in the world. Guys, as always, I look forward to talking to you real soon. Hope you're all having a fantastic day.